Welcome to the game. I'm Cookie. But I'm hoping one day you can just call me Dad. Five players. Now remember, this is a friendly game, so no tackling. Oh, and anyone else who wants to get in can be in the audience. You can play along for your own personal score and vote for your favorite lies. Let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And everyone gets a defibrillator, which removes all but two answers on any question. Save it for a tough one. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. In issue number 48 of Batman Shadow of the Bat, Batman fights an unusual comic book enemy, blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking it's true. If you get stuck for half the points, you can use the help button and get a suggestion. Do it now! Okay, these are your choices. Pick the truth on your device now. Okay, let's take a look. Because if there's one person you want to protect you from a virus that's carried by bats, it's Batman. And these incredible bluffs somehow went unselected. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Scientists believe over 30% of the distant planet, 55 Cancri E, consists of pure blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> uh, 
And nobody picked any of these other lines. Time to pick a category. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Okay, here's the question. A Catalonian nativity scene during Christmas time is a bit unique in that it usually includes a tiny figurine known as the Caganer. The Caganer is a peasant in a red hat who is blank. Input your lies now. Okay, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody picked. what we have here. We all laughed at the wise man who brought the frankincense. Well, who's laughing now? And just one lie goes unpicked. round two where all point values are doubled and don't let that defibrillator sit unused it disappears after round two all right pick a category okay here's the question a high school football coach in North Carolina was suspended in early 2015 for making his players blank as punishment for missing practice type in your lies now Okay, here are your choices. Who picked what? <laughs> and it was also... <laughs> wow, some kind of a mind meld there. 
the question. A 2010 University of California Berkeley study published in Environmental Science and Technology concluded that surprisingly 29% of San Francisco's air pollution comes from blank. Write your lies now. the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. bringing in China's pollution when we have plenty of American pollution just begging to be inhaled. USA! USA! And we're done. Time to pick a category. Is it? Yes, yes it is. Another celebrity quote of great importance. Celebrity quotes of great importance. I cried over beauty, I cried over pain, and the other time I cried because blank. Keanu Reeves on raw emotions. Input your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. Ah! 
And you know those are real tears because it's not like he can just pretend to cry. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. Welcome to the final fibbage. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. And now, your final fibbage question. Louisiana is the only state in the U.S. that requires a government-issued license in order to have this occupation. Type in your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> nice lie there, you liar, you. Well, don't you feel foolish. <laughs> and that means some of these didn't get picked. Ready? Post? Enough with me jabbering? Let's go! Oh, I've got a good feeling about this. Oh, sorry, I was talking to my tater tots again. Let's go! This is round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go!
Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. First one, a ridiculous government agency that no one knows about, the Department of Blank. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Coming up next, a rejected phrase for one of those Valentine heart candies. It's voting time. And next, a unique way to escape from prison. Vote on your devices. Next one, a better name for the human bladder. Time to vote. That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. Oh. Now round two, where all points and bonuses are doubled. The drama. the show. The first prompt is an animal Noah shouldn't have saved. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Yeah, mosquitoes. Hey, Noah, you had a chance to make summer awesome and you ruined it. You ruined everything. And next is the eleventh commandment, thou shalt not vote on your devices. <laughs> next up, the worst part about being seven feet tall. It's voting time. Okay, next one. Come up with a name for a new TV show that has the word spanky in it. Time to vote. That's the end of round two. Let's take a look at the scores. Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. Your prompt is the worst person to receive a sponge bath from.
Here's what everybody wrote. Vote now. You get three votes this round to spread out any way you like, or give them all to one answer. It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores. Oh great, our new interns have arrived. I'm your boss, Greg, but I'm also your friend. Here's your desk. You're going to have to share for now. I hope none of you smell. Let's get you started with a quick team building exercise. There is too much stuff on this desk. Let's smash something. Uh, the only problem is that three of these four items are important, so only one can be smashed. One of you has four buttons on your device, one for each item on the desk. The others each have one or more rules that when combined will determine which of the four items is worthless and can be smashed. You will need to work together so that the person with the buttons knows which one to push. Great! Working together you smash that picture of Trevor's family. Oh, Trevor used to work at this desk, but he doesn't need that picture anymore because uh, he died. I think this team is ready for some real work now. Here at Bomb Corp, we make lots of bombs, but we are very disorganized. Sometimes the bombs just start going off by themselves. We're not very good at making bombs that don't start going off by themselves. When that happens, the bomb's instruction manual will automatically appear on your devices, as well as buttons that let you cut wires. But be careful, the rules for how to defuse the bomb are spread across all of your devices. And all of you may not have the buttons to cut the wires, so you'll need to work together. Oh no. Here's one now. Defuse this bomb before time runs out, or it'll explode and kill us all. I don't know it yet. <laughs> I just scared myself. <laughs>
Great work on that bomb. Ah, oh, man, here's another bomb set to go off. Would you mind making sure this one doesn't blow up and kill us all? Celebrate with Doctor Who and S'mores! Ooh, nice job. I think you've earned a break. Now I'm thinking hands folded on the sternum, but my wife wants my arms down by my side. You know, I guess it depends on the shape of the coffin. Oh, that is so dark. Okay, back to work. While you were on your coffee break, the bombs really started to stack up over here. I'm Linda. I like to get in other people's business. Defuse these three bombs before they explode and kill me! Oh great, our new interns have arrived. I'm your boss, Greg. I'm great. Here's your desk. You're going to have to share for now. It's awkward, I'm not going to lie. Let's get you started with a quick team building exercise. Hey, let's break something on this desk. It'll feel good. Share the information on your devices and choose something to smash. Great! Working together, you smash that picture of Trevor's family. Oh, Trevor used to work at this desk, but he doesn't need that picture anymore because, uh, he died. I think this team is ready for some real work now. Everything seems to explode here at Bomb Corp. <laughs> Probably because we make so many bombs. Ooh, here's a bomb now. Share the information on your devices and cut the appropriate wires to defuse it. for everybody! Yay! Great work on that bomb. Ah, oh, man, here's another bomb set to go off. Would you mind making sure this one doesn't blow up and kill us all? I want to die in a death bed, not a death desk chair. Oh, thank goodness. I think you've earned a break. Did you catch the game last night? I stopped watching football when they removed the leather helmets. It's a different game now. Okay, back to work. While you were on your coffee break, the bombs really started to stack up over here. I'm Linda. I'm not a people person. Defuse these three bombs before they explode and kill me!
Hey, good first day. You know we're not paying you, right? Hey, welcome back. You made it through your first day, which is a big deal because the last guy died on his first day here. <laughs> Poor Trevor. Anyway, now that you know the ropes, defuse this bomb before we all die. <laughs> Let's all celebrate by catching my improv show tonight! Uh. You're getting so good with these bombs, but unfortunately, I have a much more daunting task for you. Filing! You'll each receive a list of names on your device. Pressing the buttons one at a time, put the names in the correct order. Oh, and if you get something wrong, uh, the filing cabinet will blow up. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sucks. Good luck! <laughs> Hey, welcome back! You made it through your first day, which is a big deal because the last guy died on his first day here. <laughs> Poor Trevor. Anyway, now that you know the ropes, defuse this bomb before we all die. <laughs> getting so good with these bombs, but unfortunately, I have a much more daunting task for you. Filing! Oh, and if you get something wrong, uh, the filing cabinet will blow up. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sucks. Good luck! <laughs> Hey, welcome back! You made it through your first day, which is a big deal because the last guy died on his first day here. <laughs> Poor Trevor. Anyway, now that you know the ropes, defuse this bomb before we all die. <laughs> getting so good with these bombs, but unfortunately, I have a much more daunting task for you. Filing! Oh, and if you get something wrong, uh, the filing cabinet will blow up. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sucks. Good luck! <laughs> Thank you.
They can kill Firefly, but they can't kill us. All I'm saying is I think we would be better off if the government installed high-tech tracking devices in our brains. Yeah, I guess. I'm right, and you know it. Oh, sorry about that filing. Filing is the worst. Oh, I have a much easier task for you. Defusing these three bombs before they kill everyone in the office. Hey, welcome back! You made it through your first day, which is a big deal because the last guy died on his first day here. <laughs> Poor Trevor. Anyway, now that you know the ropes, defuse this bomb before we all die. <laughs> Crowding around me, I'm gonna suffocate! You're getting so good with these bombs, but unfortunately, I have a much more daunting task for you. Filing! Oh, and if you get something wrong, uh, the filing cabinet will blow up. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sucks. Good luck! <laughs> What if what you see as red, I see as blue? Well, maybe that could happen. And what if what you call dogs, I call cats? Okay, I'm going back to my desk. Sorry about that filing. What year is this? Oh, I have a much easier task for you. Defusing these three bombs before they kill everyone in the office. If this was an HBO show, today would be the penultimate episode of the season! We haven't met. I'm Megan. <laughs> Greg said to defuse this bomb. It might be more complicated than you're used to. Don't screw up. I have dinner plans tonight. <laughs>
I'm getting really into the name of the wind books. Oh, I thought you would have blown up by now. I guess I can take down that ad for more interns. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Wednesday, my least favorite day. Come on, Greg, keep it together. Anyway, you know the routine by now. Two bombs to defuse, blah, blah, blah. Don't kill us all, blah, blah, blah. Bomb. There's no excuse for keeping the projector on in the conference room. Well, things are looking up. Except for this next bomb that might kill us all. Wednesdays, am I right? Oh, also the instruction manual for this one was written by children, which is probably a workplace violation of some kind. <laughs> People say I yell too much. Oh, no, they don't. Yes, they do! Hey, I'm Gavin. Greg's on the phone with his parole officer. He hates Wednesdays. You should probably defuse these three bombs before he gets back. Uh -oh. 